Historically, standard urine culture has been the preferred testing method for UTIs, despite known limitations that are especially problematic for patients with complicated and elevated risk UTIs. First, standard urine culture testing takes three to five days to provide a result. This significant delay to result is a major reason that empiric therapy, or treating prior to availability of definitive microbiology test results, is commonly used for UTIs, which results in poor antibiotic stewardship and can lead to poor patient outcomes with rising antibiotic resistance. Standard urine culture also favors the growth of E. coli over other pathogens and generally does not identify fastidious organisms, many of which have been shown to cause UTIs. Polymicrobial infections commonly result in a mixed flora or contamination result with culture, leaving the provider with limited information for these cases of presumptive UTI. Even in those cases where more than one bacteria are found, isolate AST testing does not account for bacterial interactions that can change antibiotic resistance. One study found that standard urine culture missed 67% of uropathogens in patients with severe urinary tract symptoms, and 36% of the patients experienced persistent symptoms after receiving directed treatment based upon culture results. Together, these limitations can leave clinicians with limited information on organism type and antibiotic susceptibility in cases of suspected UTI. These limitations identify the areas where advanced UTI testing may be beneficial to providers and patients.